Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. Let's uh, try that again, shall we? Now, uh, <laughs> uh, okay, we don't really have uh, much to play with. Um, we're going to have to be very cautious. I've been playing a lot of Bloodborne, uh, and I'm about six bosses in to Bloodborne and a couple of the challenge dungeons. And... Um, this is harder than Bloodborne. And no. <laughs> I genuinely mean that. This is way more challenging and difficult and frustrating than Bloodborne. But that, I suppose that's because uh, Bloodborne is supposed to be, you know, the way it is. Whereas this isn't how you're supposed to play this game. Um, right. Once more, we're feeling, I suppose. Let's go use our pea shooters. To, oh, fuck off, Ashley. I've forgotten about her. Oh, that voice. Oh, it's evil. I might look at a mod where you can actually remove her voice. Um, okay. God, can you imagine being in the same room as her voice actress? Oh, you'd want to kill yourself. Really would. Yeah, we could have shot that light out, but it doesn't matter. Either way, we're in the shit. So, you know. Right, there we go. Let's see what we can do here. Come on, baby. Come on. Knife those enemies. Knife those enemies. Knife those enemies. Uh, health. Right, can you settle down, please? Alright, can we kick? We can kick. Alright, grab you. Grab you. Reload. I'm going to get hit, aren't I? Nope, we're okay for now. You can fuck off, mate. Now, give me the bullets. As long as the game stays somewhat generous in giving us bullets, we should be... Oh, yeah. Great. Lovely. Wonderful. Even. Perfect. Come on, sweetheart. Take your medicine. That's it. Oi. No missing now. There we go. Keep it going. Open wide for daddy. Oh, okay. Right. More handgun bullets. Now, where are the rest of these? Ah, uh, yeah. You. Okay. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. Hang on. I remember now. Okay. So, apparently we can get shot through that gap. We just... I guess glitched out last time let's shoot that for shits and giggles I don't know okay right let's try that again actually I think it's better if you don't shoot it out because they will come to you and they will come to you grouped up whereas now We're kind of in a little bit of an issue. Okay. Oh, that um, helped me, actually. Thanks, mate. Now, if you could die, please, before that ammo disappears, I would be very much appreciative of your sacrifice to the Empire. Sacrifice your life to the Empire, sir. Come on. I don't know what the fuck he was doing there. He's sticking his tongue out. I'm going to cut your tongue out, mate, with my knife. Where is the necktie? Oh, last magazine. Uh, I guess we don't have enough bullets. Oh, great. Shotgun shells. Uh... Yay, I guess. Alright. Okay. Let's try this. 
up close and personal, shall we? Reload. Unfortunately, we're going to have all the other idiots come out now. This is going poorly. I mean, of course it's going poorly. Right, and apparently... Oh, we're stuck. Yeah. Ow. Oh, okay. And, of course, we can get stun-locked to the point where, you know, we can't move. Because, you know. Okay. Well, let's use grenades. I guess. I guess. Uh, I don't really want to. See, the thing is, I mean, we could use the magnum on him, but we kind of need that. <laughs> you know? For, like, other things. Because we have nothing else. Uh, okay. Right. Let's start knifing. Thanks, pal. You know what? Let's get the shotgun out. The shotgun uh, is now also really ineffective against these guys. That's fine. Is it? Did I say that's fine? I mean, I guess it's fine. It has to be fine. I mean, I guess we could try improvising. I, 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 I don't know what that means, but we could try it. There we go. Uh, okay. Now. Oh, cool. You're up. Again. You're dead. Nice. Uh, now, nah, we just got matey boy. Which I guess we're just going to use grenades on his ass. Because we don't really have many other options. Yeah, cool, dude. That worked. Little bit further up. That also worked. Uh, not sure. Oh, God, we really only... Don't want to use all of these. They're kind of important. Right, let's just use that many. And yes, we do have the RPG, but the thing is, it's... What's problematic is there's a lot more of these guys. This isn't like the only one we're going to be fighting. There's a lot of these guys. Come on. <sighs> I guess the grenades... I guess the grenades don't really do anything either. Either that or it's just that this handgun is just so unbelievably weak. There we go. To the point where it is like absolutely pointless now. I wonder if... No. I don't know how the damage of the knife works. I wonder if... Um, the knife is still a, you know, valid option. I mean, from what I could understand, from what I've read, because your boy's been doing his research um, on this, and uh, basically, <laughs> the the diagnosis is, yeah, it's really hard in the late game. Shocking, right? I like the way that melee attack didn't even connect there. Because remember, the melee in this game is garbage. Okay, come on. Which is interesting, because the melee in Resident Evil 6 was pretty fucking good. It's probably like one of the best parts of it. Uh, the whole move and shoot. That's, I'll tell you what, um, coming back to this game again, uh, one of the biggest issues I have with it is just the control system. Um, it really has aged, uh, noticeably, and if I'm being honest, 
it's really not very good. We've definitely come a long way since this game. A very long, oh, long way. I think this is one of those games that was really big, really good, really important at the time. But we've just so utterly surpassed it with modern uh, control systems. Just the whole um, stop and shoot thing on its own. Which, you know, I mean, that was a Resident Evil staple. Uh, kind of seems a bit odd whining about that. Well, not whining about it, but just commenting on, on the whole stop and shoot thing. But it really is a, a kind of frustrating limitation to come back to. I mean, it's part of the game. The game's built around it. Um, but yeah, it's just playing, say, the remake of Resident Evil um, uh, 2 and 3. Yeah, and say what you want about those games, they definitely weren't perfect by any stretch of the imagination. But once you've had that kind of control freedom, oh come on, why why is he getting closer to me? You're supposed to be going backwards, not forwards when I shoot you. That's not how it works. But yeah, so Resident Evil 2 and 3 Remake. Um, I love the controls, you know, because they control like a, a you know, proper game. Um, the third person action. It's probably my favorite Resident Evil, um, to be honest. I'd like to say a trilogy, but it isn't actually a trilogy yet. Two make and three make. I mean, admittedly, the games themselves have their issues, absolutely, especially from like a story standpoint and stuff like that. Can't defend that. But the way the games played and controlled was really nice. Very happy with that. And um, after playing quite a lot of those recently, coming back to this is. Oh dear. It's. Yeah. Definitely aged. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, let's see. I'm guessing at least one of these. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Oh, come on. Where, how, where did you come from? You spiny little fucker. Okay. Alright, let's try and kill this guy. Hey, friend. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. Right. You go down. Suplex. Head smash. Bullets. Oh, not even bullets. It was money. Cool. That's cool game. Just, just, just what your boy wanted. Mom, oh, you can fuck off as well. Right. This guy's going to be a cunt. Oh, just die, man. Seriously. Oh, my God. Each enemy is like a, a fucking Bloodborne boss. And that ammo has disappeared. Wonderful. Perfect. Fantastic. Because ammo pickups disappear for reasons, I guess. Okay. Magnum bullets. That's... Yeah, okay. Magnum bullets, that's cool. Oh, I can't believe that... Shotgun ammo and handgun ammo disappeared because that's it. We're out. Uh, and I need to take the membrane off my keyboard. Get out of here. Um, well, okay. 
Oh, there's more. Yeah, sure. Why not? Actually, oh, I was going to say we don't have to kill these guys, but they're going to come towards us, so I guess we do. Uh, there we go. He's dead. Drop some shotgun shells, which is nice, because we need those. Uh, okay. Right. Now. Let's... I can't remember if there's any other little goodie boxes stashed around. I haven't played this game for a week. Um, and it's actually been wonderful. But you can't avoid it forever. We have to do it. It must be done. It must be done. <sighs> right. Cool. So he's dead. Uh, oh yeah, we have to do the other one first, don't we? Of course we do. Yeah, regenerators are going to be interesting. Um, I don't know how we're going to deal with them, but I'm sure we're going to figure it out. Apparently, uh, the incendiary weapons work really well on those. Okay. Yes, thank you. Wouldn't let me exit there then, because, you know, Resident Evil 4 port is good. Um, yeah, regenerators. So, flame grenades, apparently, really effective, which uh, is cool. We'll certainly put that to the test. The only trouble is, we're going to be down to the RNG of whether we actually get any. Oh, more magnum ammo. I mean, I'm never going to say no to magnum ammo. We actually have a good supply of magnum ammo now. Uh, yes, let's rotate. Oh my god, come on. Why does that one up there rotate really easy, but the DPI is useless with that? That's kind of... That's really weird. You would have thought that the uh, uh, motion on both of those would have been exactly the same, but... You know, making games is hard, I guess. Now, let's move on through to the other side. Uh... Get fucked. Right, cool. Give me some stuff. Give me some stuff. Give me some stuff. Ah, handgun bullets. You know... <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get excited when I see handgun bullets, but <laughs> you just, you have to remember the handgun doesn't do anything, so, you know, yeah, you can sit down, and you can get stabbed, we're just gonna look at you and stab you with a knife, yeah, uh, so as far as I can understand, the knife does... Well, it's nobody seems to know for sure. It's between 0.6 and 1 damage. It seems to depend on a load of different factors, like difficulty. Uh, the higher the difficulty, the less damage the knife does. And depending on where you are in the game as well, uh, the further into the game you get, apparently the, the knife starts doing less damage. Uh, it's not overly clear. But there is some bullshit with it. Okay. Hey, dude. Nice to meet ya. What do you think of my knife, huh? I guess you aren't actually that bothered by my knife, are you? Uh, seems to be a lot of that going on, actually. Right. I mean, we've still got a flash grenade, which is actually quite nice. Because no doubt we're going to need that later. Um, all this rifle ammo is pissing people off, which is fantastic. Uh, oh, more handgun bullets. Great. Right, 
let's have another herb. You know, uh, I'm pretty sure, actually, isn't there like a red herb here somewhere? I know we've got another gem there, which is cool. Uh, I'm sure there's a red herb around here, so we'll look out for that. There's a lot of sniping bastards around here, which we need to be careful of. Yeah, waddly dee to you too, pal. Uh, I kind of don't want to get uh, pushed into a corner, but I guess we don't really have a huge amount of choice right here. Well, he's dead. Which, oh, God. Great. Fantastic. I guess he can't be stunned because he's wearing a gas mask. Okay. Yeah, I mean, sure. Why not? Either that or the hit detection just didn't work. One of the two. Okay. Right, let's get you. Can I get a few swipes into you before your mate turns up? Kind of, but not really. That works. Oh, thank fuck for that. Okay. Bullets. Oh, we've got some shotgun shells. I mean... Yay, I guess. The shotgun's a really mixed bag as well, because unless you're right down an enemy's throat, it doesn't do anything either. Ah, yeah, there was a red herb. Uh, and... You know... It doesn't really do anything anyway, to be fair, so... Ugh. Right, I want that. I want the treasure. I want my treasure, okay? It's bringing me a little monochrome of joy getting the treasure. So, I'm gonna get the treasure. There's not a lot of joy to be to be found here. But the treasure, that brings me joy. Now, this bit, this bit was an issue. Didn't we run out of ammo or something before? I'm pretty sure we did. Can't see any enemies over there because... Yeah, why not, I guess. So they're actually attacking me already. There they, there you are. All right, let's get rid of you straight away. You've got a helmet on, so you're protected from critical headshots, which uh, I actually could really use getting on you, to be fair. Because apparently headshots do more damage. That's debatable. Okay. Right, so... Is it just him? Just him. Okay. So, if I get you to cool down, I can surely try and stab you multiple times. Oh, nope, there's a grenade somewhere. Did I say grenade? I meant TNT. Yep, there's a fellow with TNT. Bless him. Where's that? Oh. You actually saved my ass a little bit there, dude. Come on. You not going to throw your TNT for any particular reason? You hoarding it now? Like, what's going on? Ah. <sighs> Uh, right, that will have to do for now. Let's use the long pea shooter. Oh no. Nope, nope, uh uh. No, good. Oh, come on, that should be hitting. Oh, fuck off. You apps. Oh, great. Yeah, perfect. Let's wake up behind him. <sighs> right, cool. Okay, okay. Uh, I'll have 
that back now. Alright, he's dead. Can he be dead? He can also be dead. Uh, right. Money. Just this dickhead with a TNT, which he refuses to ignite. So we're going to ignite it for him. Because, you know, we're compassionate like that. Or something. Hey, friend. Not sure if there's more of them. I guess there is. That'll work for now. Very apprehensive to use my last heal, but the amount of health we actually have, I suppose we don't have a lot of choice, do we? I can hear another one, but I don't know where... Ah. Handgun bullets. Cool. We'll have the handgun bullets. Right. Now, it'd be nice if um, the knife actually did extra damage if you hit them in the head but it doesn't also shooting the TNT on their back apparently doesn't do any damage which I was pretty sure it wouldn't but it would have been nice considering uh, the TNT can be unlit in their hand and uh, cause damage okay so that was a lot smoother this time I mean it wasn't smooth but it was smoother, so, yeah. Right, let's head on up. Uh, everything is loaded. We have no bullets, because bullets are for pussies and all that. Really, dude? Oh, yes, of course, we're on an angle, and the knife doesn't really work very well on a slope, does it? Because, you know, making games is hard. How does that work? Shotgun shells? We'll have that. I shouldn't really be taking the piss out of how this game balanced, to be honest, because this isn't how you're supposed to be playing it. It's not balanced to play it like this. Right. Okay. So, I, I really need to stop holding it against that. Uh, wait a minute. Is that all that's up there? I guess so. Right, let's go. Let's go. There's a switch here. Press the switch. Yes. We are definitely going to press the switch. Ah, yeah. kind of remember this guy. Hey, friend. Don't mind if I use your typewriter, do you? Thanks, pal. You're one of the good ones. Uh, right, that's another chunk of the game um, suffered through. Got some rare things on so, what do we have? Oh, we can get the treasure map for the island. I mean, why not, I guess. <laughs> look at all these weapons. Look at all these weapons. Look at them all. Oh, look, look, we would have so much ammo if we brought the uh, rifle right now. Ah, okay. Uh, oh, can we buy... We can. Is that all? We can buy first aid sprays. Small <laughs> mercies. All, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Um. Come back anytime. I probably will take you up on that, dude. I I'm fairly certain I'm going to be back. And if I could put my keyboard on the right profile. Man, there we go. I know it's on the right profile because it all glows red. Uh, because you know, Resident Evil. So we need to go through there. Yeah, this is going to be. Ugh. Oh, and we've got to contend with Ashley shouting her head off as well, haven't we? Oh. Mhm. Mm what do we have? What do we have in the old uh, bag here? Not much. 
Um, we don't have what we want. We never have what we want. But God's willing, we have what we need. God's willing. Right. Everything's loaded up. I'm happy with the amount of magnum ammo we have. I'm not going to lie. Right. Thank you very much. Watch you guys. When we come back, well, potentially progress, I suppose. Not guaranteeing anything, but potentially progress. So, till then, guys. Thanks for watching.